Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I thought I would share some fall decorating that I have been doing around the house. Fall is such a favorite season of ours, the weather starts to cool down a bit, which means we start spending a little bit more time indoors, and I love to make my home feel as cozy as possible while we're spending that much time in it. A huge thank you to Jenny Kane for sponsoring today's video. Make sure you stick around, it's gonna be a great video. If you haven't found me on Instagram, you can find me at Valerie Aguirre, where I share lots of fun and behind behind the scenes there too. So jumping right in, what is any fall video without fall florals or pumpkins? So this is at Trader Joe's. I love checking out their greenery and their filler. This is a really great way to put together a fall arrangement. They even have the most beautiful pumpkins. I am such a sucker for the fairy tale pumpkins. I ended up picking up a couple different greeneries. I picked up two of the green kind of pokey looking ones and then those yellows. And then I loved these reddish burgundy. I thought they were perfect for fall. So when making a quick arrangement, I just like to build a quick base with the greenery. I'm gonna use these kind of pokey looking guys as a base. And then I just go and measure out and kind of trim these up. When making arrangements, I like that they look a little bit kind of larger, more wispy, and that they're not picture perfect. Just, I love the natural look. I love when the branches kind of hang over. I just feel like it just brings that natural element to an arrangement. I'm going to set this large wicker tray on my coffee table, and then I'm gonna layer in some decor books. This is Pacific Natural at Home by Jenny Kane. This book is so beautiful. Now that we're in the fall season and one of the busiest seasons is right around the corner, I love the idea of giving my home a refresh and investing in quality pieces that make any room look and feel cozy, inviting, and complete. Jenny Kane Home has everything from furniture to decor and accessories. My favorite thing about Jenny Kane is by far the quality. I have my eye on the Aspen Boucle chair and the stunning Bay coffee table. From handboard candles to soft, beautiful throw blankets and pillows, Jenny Kane Home puts the perfect finishing touch on your home with an array of natural inspired decor and accessories. Check out the Jenny Kane Home membership to experience the best of Jenny Kane Home. For just $150 annually, you enjoy insider only perks that get you one step closer closer to your dream space, not to mention the only discount on furniture. Get 20% off of all furniture and home decor, free shipping on furniture, and early product access, and much more with a Jenny Kane home membership. Join at JennyKane.com slash membership, or go to JennyKane.com slash home to create the space you'll never want to leave. when decorating my home, I always try to use organic natural materials first rather than synthetic type materials. So things like wicker, greenery, um, trees, branches, cotton, linen, those are some of my favorite elements to try and incorporate. It just gives it a more kind of cozy, organic look. It's not always possible, but I try to embrace those elements as much as I can. I picked up this little mix of pumpkins and gourds from the pumpkin patch a couple weeks ago when I was redoing my porch. If you guys haven't seen that, make sure you check it out. I'm happy to report that all of our porch plants are thriving and doing really, really well. So I'm taking these gourds and putting them into this dark wood bowl. I love this dark wood tone. And I love that the neutral pumpkins, they just add, again, that natural element, but still a lot of texture with those little warty looking gourds on there. This is my entry table. So this is kind of the first thing people see when they come in. So I like it to feel really cozy and inviting. And in the fall, I feel like the more blankets, the better. I found this really fun faux leather their pumpkin that I'm just going to add in and adds just a fun element to my entry with those blankets and some pillows. I always love keeping everything contained in a fun little basket. It adds that textural element. And then moving on into our living area, we have a very open floor plan, so I try to section um, certain spaces off. I'm keeping things pretty neutral for fall, just bringing in some warmer brown tones. I picked up some new pillow inserts and pillow covers. And like I said, just keeping things very simple. You guys know my style. I like a very minimal home, but I do like to change up some colors and some things here and there for the seasons.
You can never go wrong with a really nice cozy throw on the back of the couch or even the arm of the couch. This is my go-to blanket. This is the Alpaca Basket Weave Throw by Jenny Kane. It is so unbelievably soft. It is so cozy. I don't do a ton of decorating all over the house, but I do like to switch up some things in my kitchen. I am trying to incorporate some more mixed metals into my kitchen decor with us working on our little kitchen renovation right now. It's still a work in progress, but we are getting there. I found this set of copper canisters. So I'm using the larger one as kind of a spoon holder for my utensils. Then I found this really cute dark wood little pumpkin. Brings in that rich brown color that is subtle for fall. I was completely out of hand soap, so I grabbed this spiced pumpkin and I'm putting this into my hand soap container for a nice little festive soap when we wash our hands. I decorated with a lot of fall florals this year. If you missed that video, I will link it here. This gorgeous vase and these, yes, they're faux florals are still looking as beautiful as ever on our countertop and our lighter and brighter kitchen too. These beautiful natural grasses make such a statement in our entry. This was one of my favorite and first time using these grasses and I will definitely save them year after year and reuse them. They are so beautiful. Let me know in the comments below how you guys are decorating for fall this year. Are you keeping it more minimal or going all out? I find as I get older, I really enjoy those cozy nights at home with a blanket and the fireplace going, a good movie or working on a puzzle. So I hope this video helped or inspired you in any way. And with that, we will catch you guys next time. Thanks so much for watching.